Good morning, people. It is Seabass. Uh, it is my day off. Today's probably going to be a most exciting day. Uh, I just brain farted. <laughs> Today's going to be the most exciting day on the Celica build because we're going to go get the pretty much the power plant. <laughs> it is cold, so we're going to go to the panaderia and get some pan, and we're going to get some maicena tole, and just have a really good morning because I'm excited. <laughs> As Clayton likes to call it, we're taking the Smelica today. Oof, hella nice as Celica. Man, I don't really praise my Celica that much because I don't know, I feel like it's, um, I don't know. I just don't like, I just don't like praising it like that in camera, but it's a really nice car. I've, this car's made me like the person who I am today in the community and if I would've never bought it, I don't know where I'd be at right now with just Corollas, but I love you Corolla, but. <laughs> Celica got me more attention now. Ooh, battery's starting to die there. Gotta get that battery replaced soon. Look at that mileage though, 223,000, jeez. it's a lot of miles. If you live in Stockton, you definitely know about Sawayo Meat Market. Best bread in all Stockton. Got my bread. Let's get in the smell of it and go buy some atole from Food for Less. Last stop of the morning. Damn, in the sunlight. Last stop in the morning, Food for Less, to get some atole. Clint joined us. Got LKQ. About to pick up an engine. Is it one of those? Where are we at, Clay? LKQ. Holy shit. But here's our baby, the 1MZ with the EGR block off right there. So, let's get the 1MZ. Let's take this baby with us. Yes. <laughs> It's the one, it's the only, the 1MZ from a Toyota Avalon. <laughs> Gonna dump it in the 6th Gen Celica with the TRD supercharger. Oh shit, that's gonna be, that's gonna be bad. <laughs> that'll be nice. Yeah. That'll be, that'll be nice. The beautiful part about it is it bolts up to the stock GT 5 speed transmission. Oh, does it? Yeah, it bolts right up. Do you know of any other people that have done this? On um, 7th gens, no, but it's a very common swap for 6th gen. Okay. Very, very common. Right yeah, this one right here. Thank you. Thumbnail. You're cringe, dude. Place cringe. Yeah, stand next to it. Stand next to it. Get on, on the sunroof, yeah. yeah. Just don't break it. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> Your car can finally rest in, I guess, finally pieces. rest in pieces. Can you see how, how much that plastic sunroof was 
bending. The, the plastic sunroof was bending. <laughs> That's why I didn't want to stand on it because I knew it like lost the piece of shit sunroof. Look at it, it's dark. <laughs> we literally just put this on stock like suspension with no springs on it. <laughs> it has no springs. You can't get more drop than I literally hold the record, world record for the lowest Celica ever. World record, lowest Celica. I challenge you to find a lower Celica than this. Damn. Team no spring. <laughs> no spring whatsoever. Look at that, stiff as fuck. <laughs> So we just left the car to iPool U pool. I left it at iPool U pool because pick and pool was about to close. Even if we got there sooner, we wouldn't have made it. They close at they close up their doors at four, but they stopped taking people in at 3:30. So iPool U pool on the other hand closes at five and they stopped taking people in at 4:30. So that's a good thing. Um, Unfortunately, they didn't give me any cash value for this, but I, that's fine. I don't care. This is, I mean, a rolling shell at this point. Like, you can see... Stop, Clay! You can see there's nothing here, so... We took everything out. There's nothing really that much important left. We even took off the rotors. Rotors and brake pads. We even took that off. What's a leaking? It's probably coolant, dude. My bad. No, I don't care about that. I'm saying, is there something wrong? Did it get cracked? I guess we will know when we get there. When we unload it. It's... It's... It's coolant, dude. Okay. It's coolant. I was thinking it was oil. Well, I mean, we'll, we'll see. If anything, we'll see. He said, he said that it was rocking when we were driving. Just remember you took the strap off of the car. Yeah. I think maybe it rocked a little too hard and cracked the oil pan or some shit. Oh, the oil pan's the least of my worries right now. <laughs> oh, shit. We just pulled out a 2ZZ today. <laughs> it was like half the size of this. <laughs> it's a quarter of the size of that. It's <laughs> fucking gigantic. So, I don't know, five. Uh -huh. There's no intakes that are legal for that. Shut up. Your undies when you take them off at night? <laughs> gunked up, oh. like gunked up like that 2ZZ <laughs> from LKQ, yo. Oh my god, man. It's clean, right? Oh yeah. There's no, no buildup. Awesome. And the metal's not like burnt. Not on the inside of the golf club. You know how sometimes when they don't like change the oil for a long time, the, somehow the aluminum gets all mm -hmm. discolored. discolored. That's freaking clean, man. <laughs> Look at the cam loads. I'm glad. Super I'm glad you are saying that. <clears throat> I do her. <laughs> That's from LKQ, right? That more? That's from LKQ? Uh, I, I could, think they could be a factory one. Because um, there. I, I, I showed you that 1ZZ I got a long time ago. LKQ marked one of the cams hmm. on my 1ZZ. They, like, they took it off and they put LKQ on it. Oh, yeah. Look, it's fresh. Okay. What's that? Light that up. Oh yeah, it's a number. That's not factory. Kind of, look at that. Is that like water in there? LKQ special Frankenstein. See that? Is like see that puddle? See how that? Yeah. Uh, it's a little thin. Pressure wash. Yeah, from when they pressure yeah. washed it, probably. I wonder they what that, that is, 15-05H. Huh? They do that. They pressure that. wash their shit. It could just be assembly inside. stuff. No, not, not... Yeah, you know, if they just looked at it, marked it, and then put the cover back on... Why, it was why, you think, why you think in the video I said that my 2ZZ was hella clean from the outside, but then when I opened it up, it was just a gunked up mess? Like your undies, huh? I really hope LKQ's <laughs> watch. I really hope LKQ watches this video. Don't they sponsor you? 
Huh? No, they don't sponsor me, and I'm doubt they're ever going to. They're gonna be like, who's this kid <laughs> working on? Say, just give us a shot on you. Get to take the motor. You know who did sponsor me with free T-shirts and beer cozies? Carpart. Carpart. If you guys watch this video, beer cozies. You don't drink. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> You drink wine with Irvin. <laughs> wine cooler. Well, Irvin, when's the last time we drank wine together? Uh, forever. Let's <laughs> see. There you go. I don't really drink that much anymore. Like the kids in high school, dude. Like, let's drink wine cooler. <laughs> but car part. If you guys watch this video, thank you guys for sending me the free T-shirt and the beer cozies. <laughs> Appreciate it.